The F-15 Eagle is designed for aerial combat and bomb-to-ground attacks, but the production of the F-15 Eagle is not very much. America has 254 aircraft with the F-15A, B, C and E models and some have been modernized. Israel has only 43 aircraft since entering the Air Force, with a total of 14 F-15A, B, C and D aircraft. Japan modified the F-15 aircraft into Mitsubishi F-15J and F-15DJ. Saudi Arabia has 70 F-15Cs and Ds. Development of the F-15 was retained by the U.S. Air Force until 2025 after it was announced in 2017, and production of the F-15 only ended until the end of 2019, or 47 years after the aircraft was built. The need for the F-15 when American defenses wanted a cheap aircraft with two maneuverability replaces the A-4 Skyhawk and LTVA-7 Corsair for aerial combat, and combined bombardment capabilities such as the Northrop F-5. The history of the F-15 when the challenge arose from the Soviet state. In 1967 the Soviets had the Mikoyan Gurevich MiG-25 interceptor. Designed to fly high to supersonic speeds, the target of this aircraft is high speed to intercept incoming enemy fighter planes. The MiG-25 speed was Mach 2.8 but it was the design of the aircraft that created problems, because it is heavy with a combination of stainless and aluminum, beats MiG-23's ability for speed. The F-15 Eagle has the ability to fly high and reach speeds of up to Mach 2.5, equivalent to 3,000 km per hour. At low altitudes it can reach Mach 1.2, for combat in the air can reach a cruising range of 2,000 km, while the ability to fly the ferry reaches 5,500 km with three additional tanks. The altitude of this aircraft reaches 20 kilometers from the surface or the equivalent of 2x the height of a commercial aircraft. 